Hi, I'm Patricia Leonard with Runway to Success, and I'm here in my office on Black Friday. And um, most of you know that I speak and coach women specifically on empowerment and leadership strategies. Well, one of the workshops that I have is called, What Do You Do When a High Heel Breaks? And looking at that from the standpoint of how do we respond when a high heel breaks, it's really about disappointment and how we handle disappointment in our day in and day out lives, which is something we're always going to be facing. Well, I have to tell you a situation about myself that happened this weekend uh, or this week on Thanksgiving. I had purchased a ticket uh, way back in May or June to go to California to visit my family over Thanksgiving, which I do every year. And my son called a couple of nights before Thanksgiving and said, Mom, maybe you better rethink coming out here because of the COVID-19, the quarantines and the flight warnings. And so I listened and uh, then I went uh, to my computer and I canceled my trip. Very nice. They didn't give me any static or anything at all. And uh, then the next step was I sat on the couch and I cried. I had red circles around my eyes. And I thought, oh my gosh, I'm not going to get to see my grandchildren. And so um, then I thought about FaceTime. And so I got on the phone and called and got on there with my grandchildren and we acted crazy for about 30 or 40 minutes. And we had the best time. And I forgot about my crying by that time. I thought, oh, this is fun too. I can do this. So, um, so I got up then on uh, Thanksgiving morning and I thought, wow, what am I going to do today? Um, I, I guess I'm by myself and um, I, can, I guess I could do anything. And I looked out the door and the neighbors were all gone and they were going places. And my first inclination <laughs> was to feel sorry for myself. The second thought is, no, make something out of this day. You evidently, you were supposed to be here because I do believe that things happen the way they're supposed to happen in life. And we have to learn how do we respond? And that's what this is all about. When you break a high heel, how do you respond to that disappointment? And uh, so I got up that morning and took my shower and washed my hair and put on my makeup like I was going someplace. And um, then I sat down and watched part of the Macy parade. Then I came into my office and I've been uh, taking a course, online course from John Maxwell called Leader Shift. And so I took uh, a couple of those videos and uh, got deep in really looking at uh, what he's thinking about and what he's saying about leadership, but leader shift. How do we shift our lives to grow personally and professionally. And I knew that Thanksgiving was the day for me to grow personally and professionally too in what I speak about and help tell others that these are the ways that they can go about um, dealing with uh, being uh, more of a leader and feeling empowered. So anyway, um, the day went on and I was having a good time. I was really having a good time. And the thing is, I learned a lot about myself. What we teach a lot is what we need to learn ourselves. And so I spent some time really, and I wrote a blog and I jotted down the notes that John Maxwell was talking about. And I realized I put a parallel between what he was saying and where I was in that moment. Because it's easy to say, here's what you do to somebody else. But when you're in that moment, you're going to, if you stop and look at yourself, you're going to find yourself 
um, maybe behaving in some ways that you're saying, if you can't change it, how can you deal with it? And so I thought, okay, I'll go out to visit them at Christmas time, or I'll go out to visit them uh, in the spring. And in the meantime, we can do Zoom or Facebook. So I started looking at alternatives and I started to understand that sometimes things happen for our better good. And just because it didn't fit our plan, we tend to be angry about it or be upset about it. So I learned a really big lesson and I just wanted to share that because no matter who we are or what we train or coach others on, we have to stop and go through those same kinds of things ourselves or we can never be a good coach, a good partner, a good friend, a good grandmother, a good mother. So my Thanksgiving turned out to be really great and I am so grateful. I'm sad that I miss my grandchildren, but I will see them and we had a great time on Facebook. So today is Black Friday and what am I doing? I am not going shopping. <laughs> First of all, I don't need anything and then secondly, I think I'm just going to stay at home and take advantage of this time that has been given to me uh, just to be quiet and learn a little bit more about myself. So the next time a high heel breaks, maybe something that I said today will add value to the way you deal with it. Hopefully you're going to have a great rest of the year and no, I know you will. Have a great rest of the will of the year and may 2021 be fabulous. That's what I'm counting on. Love you all. Talk to you later.